Hi my loves, Taurus, Sun, Moon, and Rising. This reading is for you. But um, this is a general reading for Taurus. So if the message isn't resonating with you, then it's not your reading, okay? So Taurus, your dreams need a practical plan. I feel like I look crazy, but what else is new? Your dreams need a practical plan, Taurus. Also, the song that just came on is sweatpants by childish gambino um it's like don't be mad because i'm doing me better than you doing you um so i'm gonna use my letterman deck and see what comes out for you um, the heart and the clouds okay so there could be some clouded judgment here in regards to something that you love something that you're passionate about this could be other people's projections and fears that you're taking on there's some confusion here in regards to something that you love okay so I'm going to use a tarot then since not a lot of cards wanted to come out for the Letterman. We will take that, I guess, for your overall energy or... Hmm. What does Taurus need to know for their highest and their best? What does Taurus need to know for their highest and their best? What does Taurus need to know? Can you give me three cards for Taurus, please? Sun, Moon, and Rising. Give me three cards for Taurus, please. Sun, Moon, and Rising. We have the Page of Cups coming out, okay? So this is that heart energy. This is water energy, okay? Pisces energy. We have the Knight of Cups in reverse, okay? What else? Give me one more for Taurus. Give me one more card for Taurus, please. And justice reverse Libra energy. If and I don't know if this is you or someone else yet, um, but you cannot escape karma, especially now during Libra season. Okay, um, make sure that ooh, the energy that you're putting out is the energy that you want to get back. If you're giving love, you're gonna get love back. I feel like you could be dealing... Okay, so you are in a karmic cycle with somebody. Um, Knight of Swords on the back of the deck. Someone does want to communicate with you. They could be wanting to apologize for something that they've done here. Okay? I am getting hesitation though. Like this person could... Like they want to communicate but that doesn't mean that they're going to because... They, were, they did something that's out of pocket. They did something that wasn't right, period. So this person is getting their karma for what they've done. This could be you, though. Maybe you're needing to apologize to someone for something that you did. I do think there's a strong soul tie here. But there's some issues that need to be worked out. There's some issues that need to be worked out. You could have found something out on social media or you're going to, or this person wants to talk to you because they found something on your social media. Stop Loki, please stop, stop. Let's clarify. We have the Ace of Swords clarifying the Page of Cups. Someone does want to come in and talk. I don't want to say expect communication, but 
you could receive communication from this person all right you know who it is i have libra energy here we have the ace of pentacles someone does want to start new new energy new offers new beginnings new efforts new time new money new energy new clarity okay new communication someone does want to start a new cycle with you but this person was a player in the past this person didn't have their head in the right place in, in the past didn't have their heart in the right place in the past this person did something that wasn't right in the past i don't know exactly what it was we're gonna clarify though let's see the five of swords reversed to this knight of cups this person in the past like when it came down to communicating with this person when you guys had different perspectives on something this person didn't like this it's like this person didn't have any respect when they would communicate with you it was always a fight for the upper hand this person always had to get the last word this person always had to be right okay i feel like i'm the person at fault here i feel like is a masculine energy okay um this person doesn't want to have conflict anymore this person has learned that they don't need to always be in that masculine energy especially when they're dealing with their feminine counterpart like they don't always have to be um so stubborn taurus energy so you could be the masculine watching this and i was thinking like i love taurus energy but the one thing about it is they can be so stubborn and so kind of rigid and cold at times and 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 they stick to their they stick to what they believe when maybe it might not be the right thing all the time but this masculine energy i feel is learning that they don't need to be like that all the time they don't need to be so defensive they they aren't always right all the time loki move around go somewhere else listen to your intuition my cat is <laughs> trying to sit on my lap but i don't want her up here all right we have the three of cups reversed to the um justice in reverse and the death card in reverse on the back of the deck so um whatever this person did so the three of cups is my third party card okay um like in regards to like another like lover or something like that they this per this person that fucked up i think it's a masculine energy right they could have been dealing with someone that like someone from their past someone that they felt like they had unfinished business with but like the business was actually finished but this person still decided to go entertain a past person for whatever reason um, but this was not the right thing to do. Let's get more on this Three of Cups in reverse and the Justice reverse. We have the Two of Wands. And the Seven of Cups. This person was confused. This person who, who messed up could have thought like the past person... Um, was actually their person so maybe they needed to clear up like some confusion that they had in their head or whatever like i'm just getting there like you, you and like you and your person had an argument and because they they were mad or whatever it caused them to be in a state of being open to different options or wanting to you know fill some type of void um and so they did decide to entertain someone from the past, but they soon realized that this was not the right thing to do. Okay. Okay. 
We have Judgment in Reverse, The Fool. Nine of Cups. Five of Cups reversed. I feel like this person is waiting for the right time to come and communicate with you. Like they know you're upset, so it's like they're waiting for like the smoke to clear. Virgo energy here. They are keeping tabs on you though. Uh, okay. what's this judgment? King of Cups reverse. This person is kind of, you know that saying like a dog like with their tail tucked? This person is also kind of hesitant on coming forward because they know they fucked up and they don't want to be put under judgment from you. Um, you know like when a dog has like their ears down, like they know that you're probably gonna fire their ass up like you're gonna go off on this person or you they know you're that upset like that's how you feel um so um you know some of you might get communication some of you might not at this time because th this person just knows that you know this is like some heavy shit here you know you can't just waltz back in when you have done what you've done um uh, we have the moon here so things are going to be revealed here we are in full moon energy so things are going to be changing here all right things are going to be changing here the energy is going to be changing um you know focus on you here this nine of cups focus on what you what makes you happy i do feel like this person does make you happy you know i do feel like there's a strong soul tie here but this person needed to emotionally mature this per this person needed to gain emotional intelligence and unfortunately unfortunately it took that argument it took them leaving to go through that so that they can grow but they can only be one there can only be one and this person now knows that you are the one but you know i could understand you keeping this person in the doghouse for however much time or you taking time for yourself um you know right now might be the best thing just doing you just not really you know make this man sweat a little bit if you're the feminine watching if you're the masculine watching you know you're needing to really make sure you're coming correct making sure you're learning your lessons making sure you're growing and moving through these emotions making sure you're you know connecting and listening to your emotions following your heart knowing what's right thinking for yourself Okay, but whatever the case is with your love life you got going on, there's a need to, you know, your dreams need a practical plan. You're needing to be consistent, needing to do what would serve your stability at this time. Focusing on your money, focusing on what you have going on in regards to your work and career, and focus on the tangible goods, focusing on your earthly pleasures for focus on your material abundance is what's going to help you get through this emotional time seven of pentacles four of pentacles these are the only pentacles here got a lot of cups and a lot of swords all right but we're needing to ground down okay ground down in your energy Making sure you're taking care of your investments, yourself. You are your biggest investment. Making sure that you're protecting your energy. You 
needing to be patient at this time and transmute energy transmuting energy um There's an energy of you really having, like, you being forced to move through your emotions. Like, when you're at work, you're going to be feeling and thinking about different things. But we're moving through that, okay? One day at a time. But as the days go on, you are going to start to heal. You are going to start to see your money increase. You're going to start to feel better. Um, you're going to start to have more patience. You're going to, you're going to start to have more fluidity throughout your day. Okay. Focus on your abundance. Uh, mastering your efforts at this time. Creating stability. Creating a solid foundation for yourself. You know, making wise business decisions. Making good investments. We have fuck no. Um, so fuck no. That might be saying like the this person that you have a love for. Maybe this person actually isn't meant to be in your life forever. We do have short term coming out. Maybe this person actually isn't in your in, isn't in, isn't supposed to be in your life forever. Actually, even though you know, maybe you once did love them, but maybe they were just were supposed to teach you a lesson. Um, we have keep up the good work so you know some of you this person isn't really this person isn't really your long-term person but they did teach you a valuable lesson here okay there is a silver lining here maybe just like for you to learn more about yourself and learn more of like this is what i don't want okay this is what i do want and <laughs> we have no coming out again so um okay so this is actually not your person um but there is like there is you do have a person like there's no love lost here but whoever this reading was for like this is actually not your person let me see what shopper you're working with and then i'm gonna actually ask about this new person okay that's a lot We have vanity, throat chakra energy, and I was kind of getting that. This person that you're dealing with could have been only dealing with you because you look good. I feel like I'm talking to a feminine energy, but you could be the masculine watching this. I feel like the masculine energy fucked up. Like I feel like if you're a feminine energy, the masculine energy only got with you to like have sex or because you have money you have a high status because of your status here that's what i'm getting because of y'all would look good together but you may have realized this you know this rejection was actually god's protection and i feel like the divine feminine you're on a higher frequency here you're raising your vibration you are creating the life of your dream so that's why you need to be practical um like be for real be for real so I'm going to ask about this new person. There's someone going to be coming in that's going to be, like, it's going to be very, there's going to be a lot of passion. Like, you guys aren't going to be able to keep your hands off of each other. Like, that's the type of energy that I'm getting. Um, tell me about Taurus's new person. Tell me about Taurus's new person, please. Tell me about Taurus's new person. 
Tell me about Taurus's new purse in here. Okay. Again, you're manifesting something. You're manifesting your person, but be patient. Enjoy your time being single because when you do meet this person, like, like, y'all aren't going to be dating for that long. Like, when you meet this new person, it's going to be, like, locked, locked, locked and loaded, like, locked in. Y'all are going to be locked in. When you meet this new person, you're just going to know. You're just going to know, okay, they could be a Sagittarius, they could be a Virgo, or they could be a Gemini, all right? So that's what I have for you, Taurus. Keep manifesting, keep creating, all right? Be practical, be consistent with yourself. Let's see what angel god or goddess is supporting you right now. What? This is 20 minutes long? No way no way how is this video 20 minutes long give me an angel god or goddess for taurus angel of union a partnership is blessed and destined for greatness there's no love lost you needed to go through what you went through so you could build your character, so you could build your emotional intelligence. You're creating here, goddess of the earth, an idea connected to imagination, creativity, and nature is coming your way. You're just building an empire here, Taurus. Keep, keep doing what you're doing. I do feel like I'm talking to a divine feminine, so I love you. And, um... Yeah, you could be the masculine watching this. Masculine, you fucked up if this is your reading. But you know what? That's okay because this person, like, this was a lesson for you to learn too. And this wasn't your person either. You know, your person is going to be somewhere. But I feel like this was for a feminine watching this. But yeah, I do hope it resonated. Let me know. And I'll see you next time. Bye.